Hello, welcome to a special edition of Crop Life Retail Week. I'm Eric Sfuligoy, here with our special guest, Box Person. <laughs> As uh, some of you may remember, Box Person made a, a video with us a couple of months back, and now he has returned. And the reason he's come back is actually we're celebrating Box Person's birthday. So Box Person, tell the uh, audience how, uh, how old you are today. 11. Wow, getting big. Okay. And so I promise, so those of you who don't know who Box Person is, who may have missed the earlier video, we will unmask him at the end. This will not be the unknown comic uh, type deal. So, But anyhow, since we're here today celebrating Box Person's birthday, we thought some birthday facts might be fun. Uh, Box Person, what do you think of when you think of birthdays? First thing that comes to mind, probably a uh, birthday cake, right? <laughs> So, so some of you out there might not know the birthday cakes actually date back to the Roman times. Uh, though those cakes would have been a little different than what we're used to today. They were actually flat pieces of bread with a little bit of nuts and flour and yeast and honey on them for sweetening. Uh, the birthday cakes we know today and love uh, came about in Germany back in the 1600s. That's when people started actually making layers to them, using sugar in the baking process, and putting frosting on them. So, what do you think of that, box person? <laughs> Very good. The next thing you might think of, of course, is the birthday song, the Happy Birthday to Me. Now, obviously, I'm not going to sing that song on camera because for years and years, the uh, song actually was copyrighted. Uh, but what you might not know, you okay there, box person? Good man. All right. Uh, what you might not know is the copyright expired on that song in Canada back in 2017. Uh, and I know the copyright owner thought they had a copyright in the U.S. to 2030. However, a uh, court case in 2013 basically said that no, that copyright only applied to piano versions. Since we don't have a piano here today, uh, I guess we would be okay singing the song, but we'll skip that um, in deference to our audience. So the third thing you think about when you think about birthdays, of course, are presents. And Box Person got a present, a uh, Nintendo Labo. So uh, I know we don't have a sponsor, so I guess I can shout out to Nintendo. Um, virtual reality kit for the Nintendo Switch. So as you might tell, Box Person has a little bit issues when it comes to reality. So virtual reality seems to be the way to go for him. So. Fox person, what are you doing now? Are you sending out bubbles? Are you flying? I, uh, I'm a little scared. He's not going to tell us right away. Well, anyhow, for those of you who are wondering, um, let's find out who Box Person is and his actual face. So, if you could, Box Person, on three, two, one, reveal. <laughs> hey, and it's my son Cole. Like he said, he's 11 years old. And Cole, why are you here with me in the in the studio this week? Because I'm on spring break. Ah, and your school would be St. Paul Tigers. Take hey, Tigers. Okay, you want to wave to everybody out there in case some of your fellow Tigers may be watching. Hi. <laughs> All right. Well, there you go, folks. That's our special birthday edition of Crop Life Retail Week with Box Person, my son Cole. Say goodbye, Cole, to everyone out there. Bye. Thanks for watching and keep watching, and Box Person may return again on another special occasion in the future. Thank you.